Phillips is here with a look at the forecast. Uh, Chris, it was a nice day yesterday, just beautiful. And, and you know what? It'll be almost a carbon copy today, except maybe even a little bit warmer. But the clouds are also going to be gradually increasing a little bit more. Temperatures around the state this morning, uh, really not too bad on the eastern plains. Mostly 20s and even 30s out there. 37 at DIA, 39 in Boulder. Greeley, you're chilly. 19, 22 in Lyman, 7 below Alamosa and Gunnison. It is 14 in Craig this morning and 9 down in Durango. Nancy, our weather watcher out there near 28 degrees, 24 at Jonathan's Place down in uh, the Telluride Mountain Village, and he said there's a halo around the moon. That is a sign of moisture coming in at the upper levels, usually ahead of a storm system. Uh, it's a little breezy out there this morning, east and west sides of Metro Denver in particular. Uh, we're going to see some off and on wind today, windy across much of southern Wyoming, and we do have some pockets of winds across our higher terrain, in particular on the passes. Here's satellite and radar. We're dry, and we will stay dry today. Today. Uh, it looks extremely cloudy. These are mid and high level clouds, so uh, they should not block out too much sunlight, allowing us to warm up. But the clouds do thicken up by tonight and tomorrow. This low pressure coming in uh, will be in the region at some point over the next 24 hours, and you're really going to notice it. It brings a very abrupt change to the forecast. Futurecast for today, just some scattered high clouds. By tonight, out in the west, the clouds do increase. Of course, the eclipse is tonight, so some people may have a few issues, but I think uh, because it lasts so long, hopefully you'll at least get one glimpse of it. By tomorrow, uh, the snow is going to develop in the higher elevations around sunrise and become more widespread during the day, and then we may you get some rain showers in Denver by Monday afternoon or evening that changes over to snow during the night and into Tuesday morning. So this will be one we're watching for you. Uh, mountains already have advisories for four to eight inches of snow. No highlights yet for Denver and the Front Range, but I think that could change by tonight. We'll watch it. 50s today on the Eastern Plains, some places near 60, 30s and 40s in the high country and out west. Here's the five day forecast. So we are going to be extremely warm today for mid January uh, fit well into to the 50, some places near 60. I guess the only um, asterisk I will say to that, Joel, is the clouds increasing will block a little sunlight, so it may not totally feel that warm all day. Uh, tomorrow, big changes come. We drop, winds pick up, rain to snow, and some snow lingers into Tuesday morning. And look at that, all the way down to 32. We stay in the 30s for the rest of the week. So this, this is going to change our weather pattern yeah. for several days. Well, and yesterday you were saying, hey, we, we need to watch out for this. When will we know better when the models update? We'll, we'll start talking some snow totals tonight. Uh, it needs to get on shore, still yeah. over the ocean. So. When you don't know, you can't just magically. <laughs> I don't want to upset you. <laughs> I appreciate that. Right. All right, there's a growing.